The first woman to run for U.S. vice president on a major party ticket has died. Geraldine Ferraro was 75. Ferraro was diagnosed with blood cancer in 1998. A family friend says she died Saturday at Massachusetts General Hospital. Ferraro was an obscure New York City congresswoman when she was catapulted to national prominence at the 1984 Democratic Convention. Walter Mondale chose her to run with him against incumbents Ronald Reagan and George H.W. Bush. Some observers said legal troubles involving her husband and son were a drag on Ferraro's later political ambitions. That included her unsuccessful bids for the Democratic nomination for U.S. Senate in New York in 1992 and 1998. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.